Hi, this is Tommy Hall with MathNook.com, and I'm here to show you our elapsed time clock application, which can be downloaded at www.mathnook.com from the Teaching Tools section. When you first start the application, as you can see here, it's in show mode, and this allows you to either uh, grab the hour hand or the minute hand on, on either of the clocks, and as you do, the time changes accordingly, and the elapsed time changes accordingly. I can also change the end time and uh, the times change accordingly also. And the next mode we have, if I click uh, the show button, it will bring us over to quiz mode. And what this does, it allows you to quiz on the time. So if I was to set the clock at 6 o'clock, the start time is 6. And let's say go ahead and get the end time at 7 and guess 1 hour. Click the check button, and it says it gives me a check mark indicating that I have the right time. If the clock is, I move the end time to 7:15 and uh, change the time, elapsed time to 1:10, which is incorrect. It tell, indicates that I, the correct answer is actually one hour and 15 minutes. That's how quiz mode works. It can be, uh, you can quiz on the start time, elapsed time as we saw earlier, and end time. The other mode uh, we have is random, and that's where a random start time and a random end time is generated. And uh, you're to guess the elapsed time from based on the uh, random times. So uh, here it's the start time is 12.43 and the end time is 2.28. Let's just guess an hour and 30 minutes, just for which I know is not correct. And it tells me that it's incorrect I need to try again. We'll go ahead and try one hour and 40 minutes and it indicates that the correct time is one hour and 45 minutes elapsed time and it gives me a new random start time and random end time. Uh, the next mode we have is random 5 and it works the same as random mode except the times are increments of 5 minutes and the other random mode is in increments of 1 minute. It works the same way and uh, we can check the answer here just tells me it's incorrect and uh, Let's go ahead and just make a wild guess here and check. It tells me that actual time, uh, last time is 10 hours and 0 minutes, and it gives me a new start, rand a random start time and a random end time in 5 minute increments. Now, this application has been set up to uh, be whiteboard friendly, and that's why we have the uh, you can enter the time by clicking these buttons here, or you can enter it from the keyboard. Also, the application is very customizable. You can click the lock button, you can resize anything. On the screen, as you notice, as they resize, you don't lose any of the detail and they stay sharp looking. That makes it ideal for interactive whiteboards and also larger displays. You can also click the button again and you can move anything around on the screen to customize a view to anything you like. Uh, that's our application. Hope you like it. Thanks for watching.